a punch buggy red convertible going around the corner. JML Punk's video blog! You see the people right here? I came out, they were leaning against the car. You ask them to move, they just move over to the meter. Isn't that nice? Okay, we won't lean on your car anymore. We'll just step over here. We don't give a damn that it was your car. We're just tired and hot, and we're gonna lean against something. Are you a happy baby girl? Are you? What about you? You guys are all happy, aren't you? Happy puppy dogs. Happy puppy dogs. Look at it. There's the happy Gerda. There's the happy Gerda getting loves. Loving Gerda. Gerda doesn't want loves, though. Not from them. She wants loving from me. Doggy style. Wait, that didn't sound right. I didn't say that. No. Okay. So... I'm going to go ahead and make me some vegetarian chili. And the way I'm going to do that is with a uh, Morningstar Griller Prime. They're soy burgers. Remember the uh, soy burgers from schools? I don't know if your schools had them in your area. When I was a kid back in the late 80s, early 90s and that, all the high schools and all the uh, schools had served soy burgers to the kids. So I'm used to them. I can handle a veggie burger. So that's what I'm cooking right now. The problem is it starts out brown, so it's kind of hard to uh, tell when it's done, but it's frozen, so I know it has to thaw. There we go. That's the first flip. I just added a little bit of salt to it right now. I'm cutting up an onion right now. I'm going to put some jalapeno slices in it. I've added uh, chili beans, medium sauce, Bush's baked beans, or not baked beans, but chili beans, pinto beans and chili sauce. Bushes, yes, it's gonna be helpful. So this is gonna taste really good. The doggies think so because it smells so good right now. And uh, as you see, I got the beans already in here, getting ready to do the onion in there. I'm gonna saute the onion just a little bit first before I throw it in there and start heating everything up. Cut up some jalapenos, and we'll go from there. And then I'll let you know how it tastes. Okay, a little bit of butter in there before I add the onions. Okay, I've removed the patties, and I put the onions in. Now I'm sauteing them just a little bit in the heat and a little bit of salt that I had in there. Okay, these don't cut up very well. And let me try it. Let me try a little bit of this. Mmm. Pretty good. Okay, I got the meat cut up now. I'm just going to put it in here into the uh, beans. I got the uh, onion sautéing. Okay, so I saved one piece. I, I was sampling it as soon as I started cutting it, and you guys didn't see me sample this, but it tastes pretty good. I definitely cooked it too long. Okay, now it's all cooked and simmered together and it's ready to be eaten. So I'm going to consume it and I'll let you know how I like it. Alright, and Paige is getting sushi. Cut. Hey! Okay, so we just had a big mishap here with Willow. Paige is cleaning up the mess, but uh, I'm not going to show you in the garbage. She just broke a glass. Willow likes to stick her chihuahua face down into the glass and drink whatever liquid we're drinking. And while the glass was sitting right here, there's some more broken glass pieces right there. Yeah, the two that you put up there. And little Miss Willow got punished, so now she's sitting in her crate like, I'm so sorry, I didn't mean to do it. Love me. And all the other chihuahuas were freaking out like, what happened, what happened, what happened? And then we had to get them out of the room so they wouldn't get cut. So I put them in the front room area. And Paige was a little stressed, but she's better now, right, Paigey? Oh yeah, tell them what happened. So we haven't been to the dentist in a while, and I decided well, it's time for us to go. So Jay doesn't like the dentist, and I don't either, but his childhood dentist is one his parents also went to, and I found out they're still open. So I called down there, and I already called my insurance company to find out what the deal was, and I called them, and they're like, 
we're out of network, but you know, you still get your discounts, blah, blah, blah. I'm like, okay, well, you can tell me how much it is so I can calculate what 20% is, because so, that's what I have to pay. And she goes, oh, well, it's $190. And I'm thinking, okay. And then it's like, and it's, you're going to have to pay $60 also on top of the 20% because that $60 isn't covered by insurance. I'm like, what's that for? It's like, because we do two different types of x-rays. One does each t t um, tooth individual, and one does, like, the whole mouth. I'm like, can you not just do one or the other? No, insurance companies only char allow you to do it once every three years. And unless you have an old one within three years, then we have to do both. What if I don't want to do both? You need to go to a clinic then. Fuck you. <laughs> that was funny. Paige was really pissed off at them too. And you know, they might be mad at us. I don't know. They came to our wedding several years ago and maybe we haven't said hi since I don't know but uh, it's not my fault they haven't said hi either now we're having a crisis Paige is on the phone so I can't talk too loud she's ordering her sushi but one of the reasons why I made the chili is because we had saltine crackers and I can't find the box of saltine crackers it's not in here see we have a complete cupboard and I can't find the saltine crackers that's one of the reasons why I made chilies, because they're saltine crackers. That's it? I oh. thought we had a big box of saltine crackers. We did, but it only had two things left in it. Paige has been eating saltine crackers? Well, that and little bitch Lane. Not Lane, Willow. Are you in a bad mood against Willow? Let's yeah, hug me. YouTube hug her. Aww. Are you going now? Don't worry about the crate. It's too hot to be pulling that out of the car. Yeah. Don't stress yourself with the heat right now. YouTube says leave it alone. Make yourself happy. Go get your sushi. I'll eat my chili. It's gonna take 15 minutes. It takes you 15 minutes to get over there. Yeah. Bye. Bye. Have fun storming the castle. Bye, YouTube. <laughs> that was that was really nice of her to say bye to you guys. Okay, there's my chili. I'm ready to go eat it now. I found the saltine crackers, or Paige found the saltine crackers. Hey, and if you ever have to use salt, which salt is kind of bad for you, but if you want really good flavored salt, use sea salt. It doesn't have to be Morton's. You know, uh, we also have sea salt from around the world. Paige has this thing. She collects sea salt. See? We have uh, Tibetan sea salt up here. Um, somewhere... Ah, oh, here it is. Like our spice cabinet. Look at that. Himalayan pink sea salt from Tibet. That's where it came from. That's cool. She's got a little grater in there. And she makes the sea salt that tells you the whole little thing back here from the foothills. Blah, 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 blah. If you pause it right now, you can probably read that. Okay. And then we also have French, even though I don't like the French. But we have French sea salt. And the French is a whole nother story. I don't like the I don't mind the French people and I don't mind the French food. I don't like the French government. So Canadians don't get up in arms at me. But uh oh yeah, fajita seasoning. You gotta have fajita seasoning if you're gonna eat Mexican. Okay, I was about to finish for the evening and go ahead and start editing, but I just had to say one thing because I'm really excited about this. This is kinda cool. The uh golfer video, I cut it down to a thirty seven second shorter one because everybody kept on saying I should. I don't know, am I filming myself right? Hopefully. Um, where was oh, the 37 second video. On it. And then I posted it to Charles Trippy's site on Facebook and said, you know, it, it's down because it was in Palm Harbor at Landsborough Country Club. That, hey, check this out, you know. Uh, I said, epic fail, golfer in Palm Harbor, Florida. And then I posted on there. He loved it. That's, I, I'm just, I, I like the fact that he loved it. I mean, I, I feel like, well, he's famous, come on, it's Charles Trippy. he was the first YouTuber that I actually sat there and started watching all the way through. Thank you, Charles. Uh, you, he's the one that turned me on to wanting to vlog and everything else, and this is great, you know. And here he is, right on there. There it is on uh, the comments, Charles Trippy. ha 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 ha, pwned. Yes, and it was on Charles Trippy's, uh page that uh, I got the comment on there and and hang on 
this is even even better. When I go over here to uh, the video. Please do not try to hurt yourself. Hang on. Scroll down. Look right there. Do you see that? Ha ha ha, loved it. Yes! Yes! <laughs>